It's actually the most, one, of, one of the most common surgeries we do here in the clinic. I think we are very, very affordable. We uh, have minimized a lot of people going for medical tourism because doing it while you are still inside the country is much safer. To have someone who is responsible for you for the first six months after surgery, I think it's, it's a very, very important thing. The cost of the surgery that you're paying, it is not just for the surgery that you're doing. It is for, you know, preparing for this surgery, the kind of service that you will receive, the quality of the results and everything, and the follow-up for the first at least six months. So, and, and good doctors and good surgeons, they are all over the planet. They are not just here, they are not just me, they are all over the planet. But the service is not just the surgery, people have to know that. So, um, and I'm feeling really happy and excited that we are now known and recognized for this kind of surgery so people you know they are coming much more frequently for uh, the same surgery so um, so uh, I don't know if she's if she's happy to uh, video but uh, we can take uh, like a testimony from there see what she thinks Today? So we are in Manchester in Rochdale, okay. Great Manchester. So uh, unfortunately, uh, I'm not here that often. I'm like in Birmingham half the time. Uh, what about the other half? I think yeah, this is this is where home is, Glasgow. Man. Glasgow. Best place in the world. You're just gonna finish your food and then we're gonna start. Like, exactly yes. Right, we'll see you in the theatre then. Yeah. So today we have a lovely lady coming for an upper. Um, she is, I think, 39. She's, she's not that old. Um, so there's no much skin to be removed. However, she has a very, very interesting thing. I don't find that a lot in many cases, maybe like one or two cases, even like 10 cases. So what you call the orbital rim and the orbital margin here, it's, it's a little bit prominent. So that would need that we will shave if you want to call it the soft tissue over the open margin so you give the eyes more projection so let's see what will happen so as an estimate doctor how many blepharoplasties do you think you've performed to the top of your head i think anywhere between four to five thousand four to five thousand yes wow. i think so this is in the last 12 13 years Numbers, they really matter. Statistics are, are an amazing tool to you know, assess your performance and to know where you are now and where you want to be later. Most of the private sector aesthetic surgeries in the UK is done in Signature Clinic. Also, in any city here, in Glasgow, Manchester, Birmingham, London, Cardiff, we are center of excellence of different surgeries. On top of them is blepharoplasty, hands down. So in the last 12 months, I have operated on 1,600 patients. Lifroplasty may be like half of those patients. So we're talking about one surgeon out of four or five surgeons, and I did on my own in one year 800 lifroplasties. I feel really, really happy and proud and pleased. There are people from the States, they wish that we work in the States or they lived here so they can do the surgery with us. That means that we are very well known for many things on top of them is this procedure. So doctor, how did the blepharoplasty go today? It really went very well. The patient, she didn't even flinch, even when we were giving her the local anesthetic, which was great. The surgery took in time uh, around 25 minutes today. Uh, it went really well, really pleased uh, how it looked like after. Sometimes I, if the patients are happy, I just show, show them the, the bits that we took out, just to know how much was hiding the beauty of their own eyes. Uh, hopefully within the next two or three weeks, she will be, she will look and she will feel much better than now. And are you confident of her having a really good result when she's healed? Yeah, I think uh, she, will, she will love it. I think everyone will be a big fan of, of the new amazing set of eyes.